Hey guys, what's up Taurus? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading. Ooh, so just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. And if you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that is below as well. All right. Oh, shit. Taurus for some. Oh, all right. You got the nine of pentacles, the eight of wands, the five, five of pentacles. For some, there could have been some financial setbacks, particularly like one bill in particular. Um, so don't overspend. But also for some, you could be single and there's somebody that you're missing or they're missing you. We're going to clarify and see, but it does look like you're kind of letting go of something. All right, what's coming up for Taurus, please? Immediate future. There's that Five of Pentacles again. The Five of Pentacles, can, it's a card of loneliness, of loss, of abandonment, feeling abandoned. Um, you also, it could be financial difficulties. Oh, well, it's gonna something here is about to like you have like this this colder, darker, sadder, more down energy over here. Whoever that's we're gonna clarify and see. But then it's like that completely turns around and there's this confidence, this big like boost forward. It's like feeling like this. But with the five of pentacles, um, you can see like the keys there. So sometimes it's not like there's a way around not feeling that way. And the Five of Pentacles is also Taurus energy. So um, it just breaks down to like a specific beacon. So show me this Five of Pentacles, please, for Taurus. There's such a huge turnaround over here. You're coming in as very attractive. The Queen of Wands has options as well. Show me that Five of Pentacles, please. The Ten of Cups and the Star Aquarius energy. Somebody had this recently, but I can't I can't remember who it was, if it was you guys or not. This looks like somebody who's been silent, and this is feeling a lot of feelings of loss, of like a situation where there's a, a tight emotional connection. This is like your emotional fulfillment, something that you wished for, that you hoped for. Possibly a past person, but it feels like around that, like there's on someone's side, somebody's been experiencing a lot of feelings of feeling down, feeling forgotten about, you know, like what, what was really wanted was lost there. It's a hard feeling. This may kind of also bring up past issues for someone, um, like er, way earlier childhood type stuff. All right. Show me this queen of wands, please, for Taurus. You got the Queen of Wands, the Ten of Wands. There's a confidence that's here, like a drive. Um, you got the Ten of Wands and the Eight of Swords. For some, be mindful of card troubles if you are traveling. But something here has not been easy, but it's like you worked your you worked your way through it. Could be worried. It almost feels like you're pushing through something and that's got someone worried. Let's see what's at the bottom. Yeah, you have options here. But you do have somebody back here. It could be a water sign. Who it kind of more so looks like it's kind of just sitting there doing some, doing thinking. But more, this person could be like a drinker. <clears throat> You're on someone's mind back here. But they're not sure. They're not saying much. It does feel like they're drinking a lot or something like that. The King of Cups, the Devil kind of stuck in a comfort zone back here but you're pushing through something here although you may be nervous about letting go of something or kind of this feelings of lost here lost sorry not lost you got the wheel 
that's great. That's destiny. That's divine timing. That's fate. So don't fear the change. My guess is over here, it feels like something kind of fell apart. And it, really, it didn't. It didn't. It may have been like more of a test or a challenge. But it didn't. Show me this chariot, please, for the outcome for Taurus. So the chariot is Cancer Energy. Wow, you got the tower. This went from... Um, I don't know how to put it. Like, a, let's say energetically, like down here, feeling almost like, like everything is kind of piling up on you or a lot of weight around a situation. It's a very low energy feeling over here. And there is a lot of struggle and a lot of worry, but there's also a lot of determination and perseverance. And then this just takes off like, whew, very quickly, a lot of drive, a lot of assertiveness. With the Eight of Pentacles here, if there have been financial issues, this is work. This is, you know, it's working. Um, but you have a big drive. Show me that Eight of Pentacles here towards what it is. This is a big turnaround. The Eight of Wands, there's communication, could be travel. Your money is coming up. Your finances are coming up. You are moving forward and creating a whole lot of change here. Wow. And this took a while. Go, Taurus. There you are at the bottom of the deck. The Two of Wands, the World, the Nine and Ten of Pentacles, shoot, the Eight, Nine and Ten of Pentacles for some. There could have been financial setbacks or there could have been like a time of downness and, and maybe somebody did ghost it or just feeling really lonely and kind of abandoned. Um, almost hopeful in some situations. But now you're getting in. Now you're getting to the point where you're like feeling this energized confidence. It could be single and getting ready to, you know, getting, you're ready to get back out there and do your thing. Work is definitely picking up. Your money is picking up. Um, and you're creating a lot of change. It's almost like something had to happen in order for something to progress. And this is a lot of change that you are making. This is about to change incredibly quickly for the better. That's a nice turnaround. All right, Taurus, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. You guys take care and I will see you next time. Bye.